Circle, welcome to Foothill Horizons. We wish that you were here in person with us, um, but instead we're gonna come to you virtually on YouTube and on Facebook. If you're on YouTube, sorry, this is for kids, which means you can't comment. If you're on Facebook, we would love to hear your comments. We ask that as a member of the Foothill Five, that you celebrate and you keep it respectful. Okay, so remember that we can hear your chat, see your chats, um, and we would love to hear you celebrating with us. If you're on right now on Facebook, um, go ahead and tell us what school you're from. Uh, and if you're a teacher and you're comfortable letting us know, let us know. We already know that Cynthia, one of our amazing returning yeah. counselors, Hi. is on a steadfast virtual campfire supporter. So. Share the love and celebrate on Facebook with your comments. We appreciate that because really we wish that you were here. Um, you can hear we have an audience. We have all of our staff members here, including a guest appearance by Mr. Milky. Yeah. Here at Foothill Horizons, we are doing our best to follow COVID protocols and keep our staff safe. We are all vaccinated and we are gonna socially distance while singing while being outside. Um, so that's what we're doing for COVID. And otherwise, we're running day programs throughout this fall. We're serving about 300 kids a day, virtually and visiting their classroom and one day field trips to Foothill. So we hope to see you soon, either virtually or see your raffle entry, or we'll see you in person, or we'll see you in January, coming soon. I think that's it for now, for the short introduction. My name is Jess. I'm the principal here at Foothill Horizons, and I want to start us off with our first song. Campfire is all about silly songs and skits with a nice layer of science or just laughter on top of it. So if you have a costume, get your costume on at home, or if you have a chicken, find your chicken. Um, we expect you to fully participate while at home. This is a repeat after me song, which means you got to say what I say, and you got to do what I do. That was a long you got to say what I say, and you got to do what I do. I hear you back at home. I hear you back at home. I said a boom, chicka boom. 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 I said a boom, chicka rocka, chicka rocka, chicka boom. I said a boom, chicka rocka, chicka rocka, chicka boom. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. One more time with, more time. with, with, with Diane Rossiter! <laughs> We're going to do a gardener style. We're going to do a gardener style. I said a bloom, chicka bloom. 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 I said a bloom. Aren't you beautiful? Aren't you beautiful, Chicka Bloom? I said a bloom. Aren't you beautiful? Aren't you beautiful, Chicka Bloom? Ah. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. One more time. One, One more, more time. time. With Ariel Corina. This is social studies style. This is social studies style. I said a toom chicka toom. 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 I said a toom chicka mummy chicka mummy chicka toom. I said a toom chicka mummy chicka mummy chicka toom. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm scared of mummies. I'm scared of mummies. One more time with Amy. Pirate style. Pirate style. I said a boom, meet your doom. 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 I said a boom, walk the plank, walk the plank, meet your doom. I said a boom, walk the plank. Walk the plank, meet your doom. Yes, scurvy dog. Yes, scurvy dog. Next, we have Gabe. Yay! 
Arnold Schwarzenegger style. Arnold Schwarzenegger style. I said a boom chicka boom. 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 I said a boom chicka. Look at my muscles. Chicka, look at my muscles. Chicka boom. I said a boom chicka boom. Look at my muscles. Look at my muscles. Chicka boom. I said, oh yeah. I said, oh yeah. I was the governator. I was the governor. And before that, I was the terminator. And before that, I was the terminator. Get down! Head for the chopper! Get, Get down! down. Head, Head for the chopper! I'll be back. I'll be back. But first, one more time with Sarah! Yeah. End of the world style. End, End of, of the world, world style. style! I said a boo! Chicka-boom. I said a Oh, that was lovely. Thank you so much for singing along with us at home. Now, what I thought I would do next is I would teach you one of my favorite songs that we sing here at Foothill Horizons. And this is a very, very special song uh, because it's a song about animal poop. Yes, animal poop. And we have a very special word that we use for animal poop. It's called scat. So uh, you'll probably catch on pretty quickly and you can sing the chorus um, at home. One thing you need to know is that any time during the song when I say it was a piece of scat in your deepest, loudest voice, you're gonna say piece of scat. So let's try that. It was a piece of scat. Piece of scat. Oh, you got it. Okay, here how, here's how it goes. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that, but let's be scientific and call it scat. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. It sounds a little gory, but it's a true story. It marks a territory. It's a piece of scat. A piece of scat. You find it on the ground, shaped in a mound. It's usually colored brown. It is a piece of scat. A piece of scat. Sing with me. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that. But let's be scientific and call it scat. It was a piece of scat. It was a piece of scat. A squirrel ate a nut, digested in its gut. It came out of its butt. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. They look like raisinets, but please don't eat them yet. They're from a deer, I bet. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. Sing with us. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that. But let's be scientific and call it scat. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. I was tired of TV. I was checking out the trees. Ooh, I could smell it on the breeze. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. A bird flying through the air. Look out, beware. Ew, it landed in my hair. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that. But let's be scientific and call it scat. It's a piece of scat. A piece of scat. You can smell it with your nose. It's gonna decompose. It's where the fungus grows. It is a piece of scat. A piece of scat. It's full of FBI. You can't see them with your eye, but without them you would die. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. Sing with us. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that. But let's be scientific and call it scat. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. I saw a big old bear. I got a little scared when I checked my underwear. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. One last time. It starts with an S and it ends with a T. It comes out of you and it comes out of me. Some call it this and some call it that. But let's be scientific and call it scat. It was a piece of scat. A piece of scat. Oh, that was so lovely. Thank you for singing along with us. Give yourself a round of applause. Yay. And next, never before seen at Foothill Horizons, we have a very special skit for you. Miss Forma, you're going to love this one. Hi, Miss Forma. Uh. 
Jolly Roger. Yes, that too. <laughs> Watermelon flavor. Aye, Mmm. Hawkeye! Yes, Captain! Please scout the seas and tell me what's about out there. Captain! A ship! approaches. Uh, hmm? It is the ship of Pirate Redbeard. Oh, ah. Redbeard, ah. my arch nemesis. Oh, we will have to prepare for a fierce battle if it's Redbeard. I know what I will need. I will need something special to battle Redbeard, I will. Aye! Aye, Gore. Hmm? Bring me my red shirt. Oh. Yes, that's what I will need. Oh, the scurvy dog, that red beard in his crew. All right, now we're ready to face red beard. A battle ensues. <laughs> Chickens with their heads cut off. Ah! All right, Igor. Thank you. Put this in a safe place. Safe keeping. Red shirt. Three moons passed. Broop, broop, broop. Hawkeye! What do you see? Captain! 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 I see! Pirate Redbeard oh. ship again. Redbeard. And this time, oh. it is not one ship. It is two. Oh, oh. Redbeard. Oh. Oh. My arch nemesis <sighs> with two ships. Igor, this will be a tremendous battle. Bring me my red mm. shirt. Red oh. shirt, yes. Definitely Wise, need Captain. A red Wise. shirt for this battle. Yeah. 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 All right, we're ready for red beard. And a battle ensues. Yeah. Ah! <sighs> ah, Captain! Yes! I love being part of your crew! Trusty Hawkeye. What's with the red shirt? Well, Hawkeye, I will tell you. When I'm leading my crew in a battle, I put on my red shirt. That way, if my crew will keep fighting to victory, even though I'm wounded. So wise, Captain. Yeah, so wise. I gotta put this in a good mm. safe yeah. place for me. We may need it. That red beer. Three moons pass. Broop, broop, broop. All right. Yes, Captain. What do you see up there from the crow's nest? Whoa. Mm. Oh. Ships approach. Is it that red beard? No, Captain. No. It is the entire British Navy. Oh. Oh. <gasps> oh. oh. It's very different. Igor? Ah. 
I think we need to go get my brown pants. I guess she needs no introduction. It is. You shall see. I hope it's Mr. Melky. <gasps> Mr. Melky! Uh, Milky. Hey, everybody. Hey. Oh. Uh, I think maybe on the plane there was a lot of a lot of humidity or something. Uh, because my clothes they all shrunk. So as soon as I got here, I said, "Hey, I have to get to a tailor, Swift." Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. What did Jay Z call his girlfriend before they got married? Fiance. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I'm Mr. Milky, everybody. I work in the kitchen here at Foothill Horizons. Uh, before I, before I worked here at the kitchen, I used to work in a bank. Yeah, but I lost interest. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Milky. Yeah, before that, I was a baker, but I didn't make enough dough. <laughs> no, no. I applied for a lot of jobs at the local restaurants. I'm still waiting. <laughs> I can't believe that I got fired from the calendar factory, though. All I did was take a day off. <laughs> oh, getting paid to sleep would be a dream job. <gasps> oh, yeah. You know, when I, was, when I was little, my mom said, yeah, you could be anything you want to be, Mr. Milky. The sky's the limit. Which made me pretty sad because I wanted to be an astronaut. Aww. Oh no, I wasn't that good in school. I failed math so many times I can't even count. <laughs> when, that, when I was in line at the airport, I went up to the desk and I'm like, muck, 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 muck. And the lady said, sir, this is the check-in line. <laughs> Don't you hate it when someone answers their own questions? I do. <laughs> I used to think I'm indecisive, but now I'm not so sure. <laughs> what if there were no hypothetical questions? <laughs> I bought the world's worst thesaurus yesterday. Not only is it terrible, but it's terrible! <laughs> I threw my toaster away because it kept burning my bread. I guess you could say black toast intolerance. <laughs> oh yeah, I burnt my Hawaiian pizza uh, today. Uh, I think I should have cooked it at Aloha temperature. <laughs> yum yum! I went to the restaurant last night and had a Wookiee steak. It was a little chewy. <laughs> yeah, yeah when, a, when a clock gets hungry, does it go back for seconds? <laughs> yeah, my dog, my dog can do magic tricks. It's a labracadabra door. <laughs> yeah, my dog, I put spot remover on my dog. Now I can't find him. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milky. You are awesome. Hi, everybody. My name is Allison, and I'm going to do a little rap for you. This is a rap about what it's like to grow up loving nature as a kid, and also kind of what it's like when only a few people support you and not everyone supports you and people kind of coming to your side and supporting you even for, for no matter who you are. So it goes like this. Well, when I was a babe just about knee high, well, I loved all the worms and the butterflies and I felt the need just to crawl through the weeds, talking to the critters, all the bugs and the bees. And my, fam my family said, what's with this kid? And my brother said, it's just his style. She's a kid for the wild. And I, and I grew up, when I grew up, well, I hit the woods, cause walking out there made me feel so good, just to be me, just to be me. So 
It felt so free. I could wander here or there, go climb a tree, and I watched the hawks and I chased the rabbits and I and the magpies too while I learned their habits. And my sister said, I'm afraid she's weird. But my grandma said, Oh, I think it's clear. It's just her style. She's a kid for the wild. I like things the way they are, not inside cages are in plastic jars. You know, I like to see things running free, and I have the idea they were meant to be. There's more to life than just TV. There's the rivers and the mountains and the clouds and me. It's just my style. I'm a kid for the wild. Yeah, I like places away from roads. You can listen to the crickets and the hopping toads. It's all right here, even in the air. Nature is something so precious and rare, and you know, to throw it away just don't seem fair. Let's all get together, really start to care. It's just my style. I'm a kid for the wild. I guess I'll always have this thirst, clean water and air. You know, nature was first. Go check out the seas and the mountains and trees and go to wild places where you can be free. And when your families tell you, go to bed and they close the door and they nod their heads and they'll, and they'll just say, it's just their style. They're a kid for the wild. They might think for a while and say, hey, let's take our kid to the wild. So go out and get wild, kids, and enjoy nature outside. Yeah, that was wonderful. Yeah, it was good. Wonderful. Pause for the hours and get up. Yeah, with the hipping and the hopping. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Um, Hello, hello, Kinder. My name is uh, Gabini, and uh, you may call me the great Gabini, for I am, and uh, how you say in English, yeah, the magician, yeah, the very powerful magician, and I am here for the doing of the magic, yeah? We like the magic, yeah? Oh, yeah. 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 Okay, okay, for the magic, we must be singing the song. The song sounds like this, and at home, if you can sing along with me, the magic will be much, more, more powerful. So, the song sounds like this. Ra da 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 like that yeah ra da 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 yeah good keep going with that da 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 okay magic time ra da 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 ra da 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 ra da 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 ra da 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 ra da 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 yeah, good, yeah, yeah. Okay, that was beginner magic. Now we get a little more advanced, yeah? Okay. Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Ra da 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 Vielen Dank, Kinder, vielen Dank. Thank you, Akutus, and goodbye. Thank you. sitting 
in front of your computer oh, yeah. or your TV. It's time to stand up so we can do some human body tricks. All right, here we go. You're gonna find your right leg and you're gonna make it go in a circle in a clockwise direction. All right, so have your leg go in a clockwise direction. Your right leg, and then with your right hand, you're gonna, while your leg is in motion in a circle going clockwise, you're gonna draw the number six in the air. Oh! You can't do it, it's messing with your mind! It's a mind trick! Try it again, keep it going, you gotta go fast, oh man, every single time it'll mess your leg up. Isn't that crazy? Here's, here's another one you can try to do. You can try to have one hand go in a circle this direction and the other hand go in a circle this direction. And then at the same time, have them go in opposite directions. I'm making it look easy. Cause I've done it. I've done it a lot of times. Wow. 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 Sometimes you think that you're doing it when you're really doing this. This is not it. Both my, hands, both my hands are going in the same direction. Or you might be doing this. Eli says he's better. Oh. <laughs> All right, how about this? Make this hand a number four and this hand in a sideways L. And now switch. So that this hand is a four and this hand is a L, pointing towards the four. Switch, 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 switch. All right, we'll end with this one. When my hands cross, you clap. Ready? One, two, three, here we go. That was good. Now I'm not gonna count anymore. I'm just gonna move my hands. Don't clap if they don't cross, okay? Oh. 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 I'm not gonna cross them, I promise. Wow, <laughs> all right. All right, here we go. introduce next you can talk about the rat oh is that it oh the time it's 6 30 already oh my gosh well then i'll tell a joke while jess is getting ready Ooh. do you want hey, tell or a joke. Think, i can talk about it i'll tell a couple quick jokes um why did that why didn't the teddy bear want dessert why give you a moment to think about it why? because he was already stuffed ah! <laughs> Oh, let me look at my list. I got three more. Here we go. <laughs> Why did the music teacher need a ladder? I don't know. Climb the scales. Teacher. Ooh, to climb the scales? That's good. To reach the high notes. <laughs> <laughs> Which object in the classroom is king of the classroom? The teacher. The smart board. The ruler. Ah. <laughs> and then we'll end with this. Hey, Jess. Hey, Diane. What did one eye say to the other eye? You have... I don't know. You need glasses? Hey, between you and me, something really smells. <laughs> what are you here to tell us about? Well, every, every campfire, we get to raffle off some Foothill Horizons gear. Woo! Woo! Who entered the raffle? Who entered the raffle? We had many schools enter the raffle. We have, from May and June, schools that were still oh, working on nice. school in June, Walnut Grove, Walnut. Meadow, ooh, ooh, Meadow, Meadow something? Uh, Sam, from San Mateo, from San Mateo. we Meadow, have a couple schools. Meadow, Brewer Island, George Hall, Sonora Elementary, right, right down there. And from this fall, we have Enslin, Everett, Martone, Fremont, Lakewood, Sonoma, Rose Ave, El Vista, woo, and Lakewood again. All right, Woo! Woo! Nice. which means we received how, like over 200? Yeah. Almost 300 raffle entries. Nice. Wow. These are students who are doing their outdoor ed at any distance, at any distance, and they're submitting into our raffle so we get to see what you are creating at home, building, discovering, 
imagining at home. So we are going to shift the screen. Actually, Alex is gonna do that and show a big spinny wheel. And we have five prizes that we are going to, five names, and those people will earn a prize or win a prize from Foothill Horizons. It will be a hat, a t-shirt, a water bottle, a beanie, or a t-shirt. One of those items. Let me see them. And you will see that shortly. Take it away, Alex. teachers your teachers will ask you which one of those things that you want um, and we will mail it off to your school thank you for joining us on virtual campfire either tonight or in the future um, we hope you have time to get outside to explore to connect to one another whether it's just taking a moment to listen to the leaves or see the hummingbird at your house or going out and adventuring outside we're going to send you off the right way here at Foothill Horizons, and that is with Alex sharing one last song with us. After he's done, we will sign off. Till next time, we will do this once a month. See you again. Yay, one more song with Alex. Yay. Yay. All right, my friends, thank you so much for joining us this evening. We really had a lot of fun. I'm going to play for you one of my favorite songs that one of our naturalists, Josh, taught me, and I hope that you really enjoy it. There was a cowboy I knew from South Texas. His face was burned deep by the sun. Part history, part sage, part mesquite. He was there when Pancho Villa was young. And he'd tell you a tale of the old days when the country was wild all around. Sit out under the stars of the Milky Way. Listen as a coyote's howl. And they go. Ooh, yep. Ooh, yep. Cursed the asphalt in the oilman, and he cursed the automobile. Said there's no place for an hombre like I am in this new world of asphalt and steel. Then he'd stare off some place across the distance. That's something only he can see. 
He said all that's left now of the old days Danged old coyotes and me And they'd go Ooh, yep, ooh, yep, ooh yep, One morning they searched his adobe He disappeared without even a word But that night as the moon crossed the mountains One more coyote was heard And he'd go